Photo Club, jump major. And more on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Beep. Izzy thought that pregnancy literally lasted 12 months. Heads up, photo club, photo club members. Last chance to submit photos for the Spring Art Show will be during the club meeting in Lab 150 today. If you're unable to attend, you must submit top shots this Friday to Mrs. Caesar's email. Drum major tryouts will be held today from 4 to 5 p.m. in the band room. Mr. Smith's 4th and period 5 class should report to room 208. Wait. Oh. Yes, Mr. President. Uh-huh. Understandable. We'll do. But then, 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 breaking news. There will be another fan bus this Friday for the game against Northmont. If you're interested, there are permission slips in the office that are due Friday. If you have your ticket from the last game, you should be good. But if you do not, you can purchase your tickets at the door of Greencastle. Battle of the Books will begin at 5 p.m. today in the cafeteria. Please bring your books with you. The Hot Dog Percussion Ens Ensemble are in gold at State Solo and Ensemble. Congrats to our graphics man, Riley Grasham, Adric Mounds, Marcus Ford, MJ Smith, Dylan Gephardt, Sam McGowan, Josh Polston, and Sydney Polston. For lunch today on lines 1 and 2, pizza sticks, line 3, soup and salad bar featuring broccoli soup, line 4, taco snack or pepperoni calzone, and line 5 is closed. Happy birthday goes out to Litzy Barrios, Hunter Casey, and Bryson Webb. Now let's send it to weather and sports. The high today is 50 and the low is 31. There's a 60% chance of rain. Here is the quote of the day. Fluff clockwise. Now to Lathan with sports. Thanks, Chris. Actually, I actually have news for you guys today, so let's get into it. Cheerleading trials for the upcoming school year are just around the corner. If you are interested in cheerleading or a returning cheerleader, please mark your calendars and plan to attend. The first trial practice is Monday, March 9th from 5.30 to 7 in Case Arena with a mandatory parent meeting following practice at 7. If you are interested in trying out for the FHS cheerleading team, please attend this practice and meeting along with your parents. The practice schedules and tryout information is available to be picked up in the main office. If you have any questions, see Mrs. Palmer in the athletic office. Next, the boys basketball team won its first sectional game as they opened up state tournament play. The team struggled early being held 4-17 after one. The team overcame a slow start shooting by holding Greencastle to six points in the second quarter. The team's biggest rally came in the fourth quarter where they outscored the Tiger Cubs 21-13 and overtook the lead, finishing the game with a huge stop to seal the victory. The Dogs will play in round two of the sectional on Friday night in the first game against Northmont. And that's it for sports, so let's send it back to the desk. Congratulations to Ivan Santos on being elected as the 2020-2021 21, Indiana Deca State Region 2 President. The following students were recognized on stage. Haley Cook, 4th place, Hospitality and Tourism, Professional Selling. Karina Castaneda, 6th place, Professional Selling. Ivan Santos, Restaurant and Food Service Management. Jace Marschke, Retail Mer Merchandising. The following students will be attending this year's International Deca Conference in Nashville, Tennessee this April. Ivan Santos, Empower Academy for New State Officers. Oscar Sandoval, Ignite Academy for Leadership Development, and Itzel Garza, Aspire Academy, Senior Management Institute. That wraps it up for us today. Make sure to like and subscribe. Also, we would like to shout out Frank for alumni, Kelby Loftner for qualifying for the Olympic trials while pregnant. Now it's a small clip of Kelby competing in the qualifier. Could it not be on me, Chris?